Okay, so I wanted to talk about the Huel unflavored and unsweetened protein powder. Now, I got this to um, make things with. What I was hoping to do is like make my own protein bars and, you know, boost up some of my other foods that I make with a little bit more protein. And to be honest, this is not good enough. It, it just the flavor of it, it's not when, once you start adding it to things, it's not really neutral. And it makes them taste pretty bad, in my opinion. So I'm not going to score this just because it's like unflavored and unsweetened. I really don't know. I, I guess maybe they're not going after people who are trying to make things with it you know if you were just adding this i ended up just adding the rest of this to shakes and it wasn't they weren't great i usually um make them with vanilla flavored protein powders but uh i mean you know you could taste the fruit and everything it's just because i put greens in my shake too you can pick up on those flavors a little bit more um but yeah, I, I wouldn't recommend getting this if you're going to try to make different things with it. For one one thing I made um, that really, it really kind of made it taste bad was chili. And you could say, oh, well, chili already has protein. Uh, I was hoping to boost it up a little bit on the protein for the amount of calories. And um, I didn't even put that much in, but it really just took it down several notches in my opinion and uh i still ate it i mean no it was obviously edible but it just wasn't good so yeah wouldn't recommend this unless you're just getting this to not have any sweeteners not have any flavors and you really don't care about the flavor i guess that's who they're making this for but um yeah, I wouldn't recommend it. Won't score it because they, it's probably a little unfair. But um, yeah, the other Huel protein powders, they're decent. That one, I wouldn't get.